Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. I am really excited to be doing a normal vlog today. I feel like I haven't done one in ages. There's Mr. Pace. Good morning. <laughs> so it is Wednesday today um, and it's also launch week. So that means I'm launching all my 2021 planners. So it's been a little bit hectic to say the least. Um, and if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen what happened to Miss Hub. She's obviously feeling much better. So yes, about a week ago, um, we're out in the backyard. Um, I was dealing with, Willow was having a tantrum and I saw from the corner of my eye, Harper climbed onto the trampoline, which she knows she's not allowed to do unless I let her and zip it up. So I started walking over to zip it up. It was literally like two seconds and then she literally came flying out um, and she landed really badly. I thought she broke her neck. It was horrific and I felt absolutely dreadful. And I know accidents happen with kids, but I felt absolutely horrible. Like I just felt like it was my fault. But anyways, we took her to hospital and they said it's really common in kids. And yesterday I took her to the hospital for another checkup. She doesn't need surgery and she just has to wear that sling for I think another four weeks. But she's in really good spirits, but oh my poor baby. So I've, um, you know, we had a few days at home just relaxing and yeah just letting her kind of rest and she's coming to work with me um so she's not going to daycare or anything so willow's going to daycare today gonna drop her off now and then um yeah so that's what happened kids hey i swear it takes two seconds and yeah i just can't believe my poor baby broke the collarbone anyways miss willow is about to go to daycare you gonna go daycare yeah so i've got pt this morning and i'm really excited to uh, have a good leg session i feel like i haven't done a proper gym session for a while we went to the snow the other week and then i just had like a week off so yeah i'm just feeling like i really need a good pt session and ryan and i have to um tag team with harper because obviously she can't go to daycare so normally day today is a daycare day um but yeah willow's gonna go to daycare we're gonna drop her off now and then then i'm gonna pick up harper and then we're gonna go to work at the warehouse for a little bit to get some work done and then i've got to do some filming for launch week so i've been um every night this week i've been releasing a new planner which is really exciting um but yeah it's been a really good week and i'll show you guys the planners a little bit in this video as well So I'm running a little bit late and I just chuck my smoothie into this and have it on the way. So I'm not late because I hate being late. This is just a Luxley cup. So it's like a nice glass one. I love it. I've been loving smoothies lately. I used to always have smoothies and I kind of got over it. But yeah, since isolation, like obviously, as you guys know, I had my breast lift surgery and I couldn't run or train or anything for a while. And then I, I you know, I was in really good habits and then um, lockdown happened in you know, New South Wales. And then I kind of got into some bad habits. I put on a couple kilos, but I'm not worried about that. But, well, it's not always about weight. And I've talked about this heaps in my weight loss uh, video, but as you guys know, it's not all about weight. So, you know, I just, I'm literally just getting back into my coalition plan, getting back into running again, cause I'm allowed to, not that I'm good at it. Yes, I'm thinking of everyone in Melbourne right now. My family's in Melbourne and yeah, it's tough. Anyways, I'm gonna head off to PT now and smash this down quickly and have some pretty good gap. Just finished my workout. My God, she smashed me. I'm not having a couple weeks off the gym ever again. We always do legs, cause um, I used to have really like weak glutes um, and it used to give me like pain. So yeah, that was good, but it was a really good session. I'm actually exhausted. I'm gonna head off to the warehouse now and get Harper and do some work there. Mr. Pace is here. There's Miss Harper. We have this little setup in Ryan's office until we get the kids room sorted. What are you doing? What are you watching, Bubba? Eggs. I was obsessed with that um, kids surprise eggs thing they have on YouTube. And we're letting her watch a bit of extra YouTube lately because of her poor little collarbone. We've got some storage happening finally. This is just from Ikea. Still haven't even hung. Like I'm so behind with this office organization. So the warehouse vlog might be a bit longer, but I love these. 
I want to put some gold handles on them as well. I love it because they look a little bit Hamptons because they've got like a kind of shaker panel look. So yes, Faye is um, working from home today because she's not feeling too well. So she can do that and I'm just by myself, which is a bit sad. So now I'm just going to write out my to-do list. Basically just got to like make some calls, check my emails, get some content ready for launch. So today, by the time you see this vlog, all the planners will be released. So I'm going to go through them today with you guys as well. Oh my God, let's get the shit out of me. You bludgeon. Cappuccino. 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 Do I have all these plans? Yes. Can you get me a coffee? Can you run away? I just need to have a snack. Yeah, I'm alright today. I'm good actually. Did a workout yeah. this morning, so I'm feeling heaps better. Yeah. So yeah, I think I want to definitely up our spiral order for everything. Yeah. I'm just like, I know I always just always forget and I doubt myself, yeah. but we'll be fine. So she left the technical ones to me. Um, I'm doing like finished the run sheet. Yeah. I'm just doing a recap on everything to do with the pre-orders. I don't think so. I think Olivia's got the Google Docs, hasn't she? Has she got that? Too? Yeah. I've sent through the yeah, description. Grey. Yep. Yeah. And our, our mailer really bags good. will be here soon too. Cool. Everyone's got their own code because uh, I don't. Just what's mine? Your code. Try and rest. Yeah. It's alright. I'm sitting. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> sitting helps. Yes. Well, I'll right. talk to you later. We'll to this now. Alright. Right. Talk to you soon. Bye. Ryan just wants to show me some house plans. Um, we're getting there. It's just taking a little bit of time, obviously, because it's our forever house. We want to make it perfect. And um, I won't show you guys today because we're going to do a full house Q&A in a few weeks on my channel um, and answer some of your questions. And then obviously we're going to be filming a whole series on the build as well, which includes like the plans and everything like that. Starting here, you can now park undercover. So that's all undercover mm. veranda. Yeah, but there'll be a big roof over here. That's the triangle Yeah, he's done. Um, it'll yeah. be fine. Like I wanted to... I think we'll be fine with this. I wanted to... Maybe you have a study in that, but then you won't have that open. Yeah. Either. So, it's getting there. It's good. Yeah. Alright. I'm going to eat food. Alright, I'll get you some food, bro. This is why I get my work done. Okay. Uh, bro, I think you're the real boss, hey. Yeah, I'm going to draw. You're going to draw him on the... Come on, quick, let's go. Guys, I got my IKEA parcel here, so I'm gonna do a bit of a haul. Everyone loves a good IKEA haul. I don't remember what I bought because I got this a while back. Ooh, what did I buy that for? Oh, that's cool. All right, let's have a look what we got. I think some of this stuff could be for the warehouse storage, and some of it's for my cleaning products. Like I haven't got enough tubs for that yet. Show you, I got this very error. So this is to store your like knives because um, I don't like where they are at the moment. I want to pop them all in here and then pop them into a drawer where the girls can't get them. But I like because you can actually slot them in. So that's called the very error. I want to go outside. All right. So rude, these dogs. Okay, this is definitely for the warehouse. So the name's called Signum. Holds all like the cables. So under your TV or your desk, it like holds all the cables up. Because one thing I hate more than anything is having like cables everywhere. I think you stick it to the table. In these. And then um, you wrap all your wires, sorry, you wrap all your cables 
into this. So that's what that one is. So got this one, this is another Very Aero product. So it's like a tub with like a handle. This would be really good for like kids crafts. It could be good for your cleaning products as well. I'm trying to remember what I bought it for. What was it for? I think this was a cleaning products for the warehouse possibly, or maybe for our place. I think I want it for general cleaning because our one's starting to get a bit full. So I'll show you guys what I mean. In our old office, I have these big Cougars tubs and that's for like electronics. So like cables and hard drives and stuff like that. So these are actually inserts you pop into them and it's going to make it more organized. So I'm going to pop this in to the Cougars in where all our electric stuff is. And yeah, I've got this for like cables, batteries, like hard drives, all that type of thing can go in here. And this is just like an insert. So it's super easy. These are like shoe holders and basically you hang them in your wardrobe, like behind the door or like in the wardrobe, which is what I'm going to do for the girls. So this is it there. Stuck, stuck, I don't know. Everything's Swedish, so I don't know. Perfect for people who don't have like a lot of room, um, especially if you have small wardrobe space and you just don't know how to organize your shoes. So this is perfect for kids because kids' shoes are tiny anyway. Probably not the best for men's shoes. Yeah, and you just like hang it up. So I'm gonna get literally just gonna hang this up in the kids' rooms. I've got some more very aero tubs because I needed some more for our cleaning products. Um, yeah, so I'm just finding like when we don't have enough space. I need one for like um, like fabric cleaners and stuff like that. But yeah, so I'm just gonna pop some of these in there. I've got some of these for the warehouse storage as well for like labels for when we're packing um, like all the parcels and stuff. Lucky last, I got one more Jonah tub for the linen closet. Oh, two more, sorry. So I've got these to hold more back stock for things like, like the cotton pads, all that stuff, just cause that's where I keep it in the linen closet and it just makes it a bit easier. So pop these together. The Jonah tubs are so good, they fit about four fit adult fitted sheets and two Duna covers. Get the acrylic tags from Little Label Co. Um, and then I just use a hot glue gun and I stick it on. All right, so as you can see, this is my little broom closet. These are um, the very aero containers and they fit perfectly in here. So I've got one for like your outdoor stuff. So fly spray, um, mozzie bite stuff, anything for like literally the outdoors. Down here we have the windows and glass and then we have general cleaning. And basically what I wanna do is make an extra tub up for sprays and fabric sprays because I do have a fair amount of those, um, like these, the Novak spray. I use this on like the rug and that, and it just helps with any smell from the dog. So I'm gonna be adding um, another container up the top there with the extra category. And then this is the other side of the broom closet. So I've got all these extra vacuum pieces. I wanna pop them in there um, and obviously label it. And then down here, I've got this um, sectioned container and this is from Kmart. And I love this cause I do have the extra vacuum pieces here as well. Mop heads, essential oils and stuff like that um, for cleaning. And that's all like in their section. So that's why I grabbed a couple of extra Variera tubs just to make this more organized. And then these are just the command hooks from Woolworths, which I like to hang everything on. All right, so this is where I store our electronics, like, you know, hard drives and stuff. And this is why I'm going to do a bit of a declutter because it's getting a bit full. I'm going to put those inserts into here and then just organize all the cables and stuff so it's neat and tidy. That's just a bag of goodies I'm going to do for a giveaway a bit later. Down here, I actually need to do this now. These are the girls' um, artwork keepsake boxes. So I'll show you guys how I've organized that. This is literally how I keep all, like, their birthday cards and stuff like that. And then these are just Kmart drawers and this is how I keep, you know, like anything they make us that is a bit too tricky to like store in anything else. So that's where I put them there. I shouldn't be showing you guys that because that's um, the playroom video. But anyway, so these are the tabs I use for the kids artworks. Um, so these are just from Office Works, and I have done a video on this before. So if you want to like go back, you can find it. I'm just going to quickly go through it. And then I literally just have the suspended files in here. So here's a close up of Harper's tub. The label is Little Label Co. So yeah, just from Office Works. Um, yeah, so I just use the Dymo label maker, and I've got like daycare 2017, 18, 19, up until like kindergarten, year one. And um, yeah, I have, as I said, a smaller version for important family documents. So like. Um, Christmas photos I keep in there, mortgage documents, like birth certificates, passports, all that stuff. And once this fills up, 
that actually does compact a lot. It looks like it's a bit full now, but it's really not. All right, so Harper has just fallen asleep for a nap, which is great because now I can quickly go through the 2021 planners with you guys. I won't go into too much detail because this is all over on my Instagram at the moment and it's Steph Pace Planners. So yes, I'm very excited to show you. By the time I post this, all of the planners will be announced just um, and pre-sale starts tomorrow night at 7 p.m which is long because it's been a really hectic week. Um, but I've literally poured my heart and soul into these planners. And for me, I create these planners to make like your life easier. You guys know I love this. I love checking things off and it just makes me feel like more in control and not like, you know, like having lists and a planner, it really helps, you know, unload all that mental clutter and you don't have to remember everything. It makes life so much easier. And it's just like, it's not about being perfect. It's just about not feeling like a slave in your own life. Because I know with me, I have anxiety and having everything written down, like journaling, using a planner, having to do this helps me so much for my mental health. And again, it's not about being perfect. Like I don't get everything ticked off. No way. But the fact that it's down on paper, I don't have to remember it. And you know, you can always get things done the next day. So, so as you can see, there's some new colors and some new sizes. So I'm going to quickly run you guys through them. Here we have the signature planners. So these are like the ultimate organization planner. So these have absolutely everything in them from like meal planning, cleaning schedules, gift planning, password keeper, habit trackers, um, mindfulness, everything you could imagine is in here. There's budgeting um, every month. There's savings tracker, build tracker finance goals like every aspect of your life is in here I'll quickly show you guys so this is the front she's so pretty like so that's a weekly layout you've got you know habit tracker and everything in there and all your weeks run consecutively and then at the back here you've got home health budget and life admin so that's all of your planning pages are in the back so you've got all your home stuff inspirational quotes look at the stickers they're like my gifts on Instagram. That's so cute. That's just, this is a health section, workouts to try, budget section. There's just so much in here, guys. Like everything you need in a planner is in here. I wanted to make this gray one because I know not everyone likes blush. As you can see, it's like gray with hints of mint throughout. It's so all the contents the same. It's just made for those who prefer, you know, more of your neutral stuff. So yeah, they are just so pretty. If you guys want to see like a full run through, hop on over to the Instagram page. I don't want to put all of it on here in this vlog because it will go forever. Also, there is all of my challenges in there, of course. So these, if you follow me on Instagram, you know I do monthly challenges. So I've put them in here so you can do them whenever you want. So these are the brand new ones. These are called the Essential Planner. And I made these so for those of you who don't want a, a bigger planner and one you just want nice and small, compact, have your essential stuff in it. This is for you and it comes in mint and blush. But just so you guys are aware, this is a sample and the final product is going to be more like closer to this color. So it's more of like a, you know, it's basically going to be the same color as that, but in leather. So it's a beautiful leather color. Um, it just takes a lot of samples for me to nail the color because I'm so picky. So it's 2020 written up the side. It's in this really nice A5 size. It's got all your essential stuff and this little cartoon Steph, something you can, you know, pop in your handbag. You can fit the other one in your handbag too, but yeah, this is for something who doesn't want the whole kit and caboodle, but you've still got um, project planner. You've still got budget in here. You'll get your stickers. So that's that one. And that comes in blush as well. And as I said, this color will be a lighter pink like that. It's a beautiful mint color. The final is going to be a little bit lighter than this. Both got the challenges as well. Because I can't wait for you guys to get these. So, oops. Oh my God, there's planners everywhere. I know at the moment it's really tough with the current thing that's going on. Um, people are in lockdown and stuff. I've had so many people, I can't even begin to tell you, message me and say that these planners have given them direction, kept them in routine, kept them up with their goals as well. Like, just remember, planners aren't just for work and appointments. They're for your routine, for your budget, for your home. You know, just all that stuff just to help keep you organized and feeling a little bit more in control, especially right now at these uncertain times. So, um, yes, I can't wait for you guys to get them. Anyways, guys, I'm going to like finish this vlog up here. Thanks again. If you have any questions, especially about the planners, please comment them below. I'll put the link for the VIP list and also the link to where they will be available at 7 p.m. pre-sale on Friday, which is tomorrow. Um, I do ship worldwide. It just depends on 
the current situation to get things shipped to you. It's a really uncertain time, but you know, if you're in Australia or anything like that, you're fine. Uh, yeah, so I can't wait and I will see you guys next week. Bye.